What is up you guys? Welcome back to Chic Blend. My name is Richenza Marie. And I'm Kui. And today we are bringing you guys a 2020 luxury wish list. If you're interested, keep, keep watching. watching. Well, let's start off. What you got first? Okay, so I'm going to start off with shoes. Well, let me do two and then you could do one and then I, you know, we'll go from there since you got four and I got six. Okay, okay. that works. So, the first thing that I want are the Gucci Ace sneakers with the little heart on it. Ooh. Oh, I want it. Those. You should get them. They are so cute, but I really want them because I have my yeah. Gucci Soho Disco in red. Re actually bought this for me. When did you buy this? Was, Was it this last graduation? year? Yeah, I think like all of my friends and family like put in to get this for me for my graduation. Mm -hmm. And I feel like the Gucci A sneakers with the hearts. Oh my goodness. Perfect red, so nice. same exact red. So I really, really want those shoes to match this bag. Mm -hmm. I still have not worn this bag specifically because I feel like I need those shoes. Those shoes, yeah. We have went into, what store was it? Was it Saks? Sax. We went into yeah. Saks and we actually tried them on. And they were so freaking cute. But we had bought a lot of items. So we just left them there. <laughs> so those are on her wish list. And that's a good thing to have on your wish list. Yes, that's thank so you. nice. Okay, so the second thing is another pair of sneakers, mm -hmm. the Balenciaga Triple S. Oh. I love those sneakers. Yeah. She does not like the dad shoe trend, but they, I what? Go on, go on those say. shoes just look thick. Real <laughs> thick. I can't even pass on a See what I'm hey, 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 <laughs> They do, they just look so big, but I feel like your foot is smaller. So I feel like when you put them on, they won't look as big. They won't look like true dad. I shoes. actually did try them on and I do feel like the quality is really, really, really good. But the trick for those shoes, they are so expensive. Mm -hmm. I am only getting those sneakers if they go on sale. And, you know, it got to be something special. Yeah, you know? they are super nice. And they look good, especially like the sporty look. Mm -hmm. So you could put it like an air when you go in mm -hmm. on flights and be stuff. Flat, uh, yeah, uh, uh, I uh, think uh, they're uh, good uh, for uh, traveling and you just look so fly with them. But mm -hmm. they are thick. <laughs> <laughs> so, yes. Okay. Okay, me next. You, you next. What you want? Okay, so uh, the most, the top of the top, the creme de la creme <laughs> on my list is the Alma BB. Oh. And you guys, so Quee has hers. She is the one that made me want this freaking purse. It's so cute. Like, we did a purse swap, and I had this bag, and mm -hmm. let me tell you, it is amazing. It's so pretty. It's the perfect size. If you guys look back to our previous videos, you know I am so into the smaller bags. So this in itself is just beautiful. And so the print that I want is the Damier Bean, which is what this is. Mm -hmm. And there's also like this really pretty champagne color. I'll put it right here. Boom. This <laughs> color. Oh my God. <laughs> so the color is so nice it's leather so i'm going between this the damier bin or the champagne so i can't wait i think i'm gonna get that soon though yeah. okay so that is a limited edition piece it's a limited edition yeah piece. i think that's like not like in the, the classic realm classic collection but yeah it is right. pretty yeah, yeah. it's so, nice and i think it's different because i usually stick to the classics which I love, but I really want to just step outside of my comfort zone and go for a different color, which is a champagne. Yeah. What about you? So you the think? next thing, oh, this is what's breaking the bank. What I really it? want a Chanel bag this year. <gasps> oh my God, you going for Chanel? I really want a Chanel bag. Oh, I would God. love to have, so like I have like a Ch whole Chanel wish, wish list. So I have four bags on there currently mm -hmm. and the three bags that I would get either of these either a boy bag and black um caviar leather mm -hmm. champagne gold or regular gold hardware for the boy bag okay. or a jumbo classic flap in caviar leather red I don't care what the hardware is except black or like the um ruthenium is that it? Yeah, like the ruthenium hardware? No. Um, and then, a, or a pink. Mm-hmm. 
a really pretty pink, and I don't care about the hardware. Oh. Caviar leather. So she is so going, one of those three. She's going high class on us, okay? Yeah. She's coming with the Chanel. Have I'm you seen the it. Chanel bag where I believe it's the boy bag? And it has the lights that are installed in it. Would yeah, you ever was, see yourself getting that? No, because I believe, like, it's so funny. My When that bag came out, my sales associate called me. Mm -hmm. That bag retailed for $10,000. What? And you know what? I love Chanel, but... But not that much. I just cannot spend $10,000 on yeah. a bag that just lights up like where i'm wearing it too yeah that's For christmas I didn't know like, it was ten thousand. yeah it's like where girl where i'm going yeah i'm a regular degular schmegula girl like yeah so what I do you have, have next and so for my second thing on my wish list i have been wanting and loving the ysl belt bags i have just been on that trend the belt bags are super cute so i did last year like in december uh, a month ago about a month ago a month ago <laughs> so about a month ago i did purchase the ysl lou bag and <coughs> that bag how it was structured it sat so far from off of my you know my lower area i just didn't like how it sat so i was looking into the ysl belt bags and i did see the cape belt bag and it's like a slimmer i'll put a picture right here for you guys so i either wanted it in black or the dark legend red and it's like a plum a deep plum color and it is so beautiful so yes what is making you want to jump on board the um belt, the belt bag, bag i just really feel like i'll be more comfortable in my outfits i can wear it with the body cons I have a lot of one piece outfits, so I feel like if you have that belt bag, it'll be a statement piece. So mm -hmm. I've been really wanting, oh, and festivals. I feel like when we go to the festivals, usually I'll have a shoulder bag or a crossbody, mm -hmm. and I'll be dancing in the field, like, and I have to keep putting it on. You know, <laughs> I feel like the belt bag, I could just be grooving. <laughs> Popping in the air. <laughs> she want to twerk better. Yeah, I want to twerk She want to twerk hands free. You know, I'm not mad at that. <laughs> okay, so my next item. So let me show you guys my huge bag. My dog is on me. That's why I'm moving so slow. So this is my bag right now. This is the <laughs> large Matalase Lou bag. It's huge. And I actually want this exact same bag but in a smaller size and i actually i think i want it in like the black on black uh-huh which oh. is very different for me but i think i want that because i would probably do i've seen like a couple of girls on youtube do like the ruthenium um strap and it just looks so good and i feel like that way if i wore like a leather jacket whether it has silver hardware or gold i think that would match perfectly and i could just switch out the strap to whatever color i want to wear so I do like the idea of that. Yeah, I feel like the black on black will be so just runway, like high fashion. Yeah, it looks so, yeah. so, so nice. And I'm like, oh, I kind of want that. Right, and I feel like that size would be great too. Because you guys, when she broke this out, I was like, woo! <laughs> That thing is huge. So, okay, I actually ended up purchasing this. Well, actually, my sister purchased this. For my graduation, I think I got like a total of four bags. Mm -hmm. I think I got a total of four bags when I graduated, and this was one of them. And I picked that bag because it was like comparable to the Chanel Double XL. Mm -hmm. I really wanted that bag, but I was just not going to spend like four thousand dollars or i think at the time it was four thousand and now i think it's even more than that oh my so gosh. i just was not going to get that so right i ended up getting this instead and yeah i think that's a great you know little situation and i do like the bag so i would just love to have it in the mini loose size Cool. Or a mini Lulu the is actually Yeah, the called. mini Lulu. Yeah. And my next thing that I want to purchase is the Louis Vuitton Monogram Confidential Bandeau in the color brown. 
I am so like Quee has a couple of these. She mm -hmm. actually has the bandeaus, like around three of them. Yeah, three or four. Yeah. yeah. So I saw her, she was wearing her bandeaus around her purses, and it just looked so stylish. <laughs> and I was like, I love pop my collar. Pop the collar twice, okay? <laughs> so I really wanted these bandeaus. I do have a lot of classic bags. So I'm just sometimes I want a little bit of razzle dazzle. Mm. And I just want to put them on my purses, switch it up, accessorize. Also, I wanted to do a couple hair looks where I use the bandeau as a wrap around my neck, even around my wrist. So it's two hundred dollars. So I'm trying to wear that thing all over my body. Okay? All over your body. <laughs> yes, every. You know what? That's a little bit better too because the uh, bag charms are uh -huh. so expensive. Right. And I think that is a really, really great way to dress up the bag, protect the handles. Mm -hmm. You know, do that type of thing. So I feel. I yeah. Feel you, oh, girl. girl. Okay. So Ooh. you guys will be seeing me with some little bandos on my purses. Mm -hmm. All right, hit it, Queen. What you want, girl? The last but not least thing that I want is the Louis Vuitton Cans bag. Oh my god! I think that bag is everything. I think it's so pretty. The first time I seen it, I was like, oh man, like that bag is gorgeous, breathtaking, breathtaking. The only thing is, it's impractical. Okay, <laughs> yeah, impractical. Like literally, I already know that I'm going to have to literally set the bag down to open up the top, or I'm gonna have to wear it crossbody right. because the entire top kind of like opens up pretty much. Because that's the bucket bag. That's like the bucket bag yeah the top okay. the top the handheld bucket bag but Picture. it does have a strap we'll be here yeah <laughs> it's beautiful but yeah i just know like that's going to be the last thing that probably the last thing that i would actually purchase, purchase. just because i know like practicality wise it's a no, but I still want it anyway but it's beautiful yeah it's i beautiful. saw that bag and i was like holy crap when we went to miami and yes. we saw it so beautiful. I love that bag. Breathtaking. <laughs> it's nice. Okay, you got one more. Yep. And for me, I have been wanting. Okay, so you know, we, you guys, we have been traveling nonstop. Because we're pimping all over the world. Oh, wow. The fancy car. We're pimping all over the world. You know, I don't know nobody's words. Right. So yes, yeah, so we have been traveling nonstop, and this year we already have four trips planned. So I really want the Neverfull Keep All in the size 45 or the 50. Mm -hmm. I'm not sure which one would count as a personal item, but I'm actually going to research it before I buy the size because I do want it to be my personal item when I fly. And so I either want it in the, I believe it's the Massacre. It is the, it's like the Damier Ben print and it has the handles that are darker mm -hmm. or the just black. Yep, yeah. the black handles. Mm -hmm. Or I just want the Damier Ben, the, the bandolier, of course, because we want the strap. Girl, that strap is so strap. important. Yes. Them bags be heavy as hell. I know. Heavy, honey. But I really want it because I feel like I can put my personal purse inside of the keep all oh, you can. and everything mm -hmm. else that I would need, like as far as uh, travel gear because we vlog a lot so we could put our camera and everything else in there so I really really want that and I feel like that will be maybe the last no I feel like that would be the second thing that I will get because I wanted to get it before our trips so mm -hmm. yeah so if anyone has either the 45 or the 50 if you know if that counts as a personal item leave that down below Sounds good. And that wraps up our video. You guys know what we're going to be getting for 2020. Yes. If you like our videos, definitely leave us a message. Let us know what's up. Hit the subscribe bell. Subscribe, subscribe. you guys. Okay. The subscriptions has been coming in and we thank y'all. More. More. <laughs> Alright you guys and we will see you guys next Thursday and hit the notification bell. Alright. Next Thursday. Alright you guys don't forget to stay chic. Chic Scott out. Today we are bringing you a 2020 luxury wish, wish list. list. <laughs> you Okay, we don't need to.
can be too crunk because we already be super loud. And then you like, where's the 